England. <laughs> <laughs> uh, my name is Paul, I'm uh, Emily's dad, uh, and yeah, we're from uh, Essex. No. Uh, I have, uh, so I've been coming to Drupal conferences for about 10 years now, and my first one was uh, Boston in 2008. I I prefer it almost to other to actually the larger Drupal cons, just because it's a bit more personal, and I feel like I can uh, talk to other people in the Drupal community a little bit better. And yeah, at the at some of the larger conferences, I find that I'm a bit lost, <laughs> you know. Um, and especially uh, like I've been to some of the North American ones, and I felt. Um, well, actually, I guess it was different because when I went to the North American ones, I was newer to the community, so I felt. Possibly that I was a little bit more shy and I found it harder to approach other people. So, yeah. But yeah, I like, I, I like, um, uh, it, it feels like I can relate to uh, the other attendees a lot more when I come to a local camp. Emily actually asked me, so obviously I've been a coder for quite a while, um, and a few years ago, when Emily was about five, six years old, she asked me to teach her some coding. <laughs> um, so, and so she's always kind of shown a bit of an interest in it. Um, and so, yeah, coming along to Drupal Camp, I felt that it would um, allow her to sort of see uh, the bits about coding that aren't just about code. If you, if you know what I mean, you know. So actually sort of the exchange of ideas and, and kind of, you know, meeting what, what sort of, meeting the people that are in a community around the software, but also the people that, the things that people are trying to achieve with what they're doing rather than just the physical aspect of writing code, you know. So, um, yeah, so I guess the hope was that it would, it would sort of inspire, to, inspire her to see what she can do with it rather than it being just a physical act of writing code. It's like, well, it's a, it's a means to an end. These, these are the goals that you can uh, achieve. I think I will because, um, well, I, I just like coding and developing things.